I think. Hello. Hello. It's Sakako here. And it's his friend, who, uh, I have a YouTube channel, but I'm not doing anything with it yet. Fet Zors, if you're interested. And, uh, we are playing a game known as Realm. Realm. Yes. And, uh, yep. There's, uh, some great sp sprite rotation. I think that's mode 7, actually. Yeah, they couldn't even get to the main menu before applying it. <laughs> I love mode 7. I really do. I think it holds up. You know, I actually think... I love to see a modern game with just hardcore sprite effects, because when I play an old game with really good sprite effects like Gunstar Heroes or even the original F-Zero, I'm just... I'm still very impressed. And, uh... Yeah. So are you, as, uh, evidenced by, uh, an earlier Let's Play. <laughs> uh, you got to watch all of them to find out which one it is, and let's I highly not, recommend you do so. One. Yes. Right. Um, um, so... So immediately we know something about this game from the options screen. We've got a yeah. jump, fire, and we've got a lock. Yep. Okay. Are we going to be um, normal, or going yeah. to make things easy for yeah, us? Yeah, you've, you've got to at least try normal mode. You're right, you're right. You know, we, we want to give the Otherwise developers... you're a high school student. Yeah, we give the developers the benefit of the doubt. We assume that, you know, they know what's best for us. And, uh, you know, it's take us for well, a ride. some pretty uh, funky music. Yeah. We're just bobbing our heads, uh, for those of you who can't see us, I'm, which is I'm not all of you. My head. Well, it's, I am. That never happened. I all feel right. the beat. Let's, in get my this, heart. let's get this shit going. And my heart's already got a beat. Ooh. Oh. Right. Um. Samus. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Hang on. Check out those angles. Wait. Uh, oh wow. This is okay. So this is COD before COD. So we start off with a homing weapon. It's possible that my emulator settings are not allowing me to press up and right at the same time. No, there wouldn't be any reason for that. It's up and down at the same time that you can't do. Because in some games you can actually press up and down at the same time to warp. Yeah. But, um, so, this game's okay. I'm shooting a tree. Yeah, but look, you get a try from oh, a tree. Shit. Except, well, isn't homing better than this? Maybe. Is it like one of those, what games are there where the default weapon's actually the best one in the game? I think Dead Space is one of those. Not Contra, that's for sure. Yeah, definitely not Contra. And this game is also definitely not Contra. Um, it's Realm. Okay, so... We have a strange mix of fantasy oh, and space. That just took way too... Way too much time. Oh, wow! Swing and miss. Ah, their points. That makes sense. It's interesting. You know, the, the, the weapons keep trying to fire their target, but because of the limitations of speed, they just keep going round and round and round. But look, we're quite well healed now. So I'm at the end of the end of the level. Do I need to actually do something? Um, it could be one of those games where you stay in the one spot forever and just fight off waves of enemies. But uh, but no, it looks oh, like there's on. progress to be made. Okay, so we've got skull platforms. We've got fire. Oh, I don't care about it. You. What's my motivation? Why? Why am I this guy? Looks like a girl for one. Actually. No, that's a, no, it's, that's it's a pretty a masculine... It's a guy like... with, like, the world's biggest mullet. Oh, yeah. Let's, let's not make any gender assumptions on this channel, but, you know. It, okay. Okay, so I can't jump down. That's a bit disappointing. No. I guess, I guess you just want you to keep moving upward. So it's pretty generous with, um, you know, re health, giving you back health. But, um, it seems like it's reasonably challenging. See, when I watch a game... I always expect the person playing it to avoid enemies very easily, and, you know, it's like, oh, it's duh, you can just avoid it right there, but when I'm actually playing, I, you know, I, I actually get hit quite a bit. Oh. It's, uh, it's tough going. Oh. Now, uh, this weapon seems worse than the one you had before. This weapon has infinite ammo. Oh, right, the other one didn't? No. Ooh. Yeah, it's pretty fast I may as have, well. I may have just run out of ammo. See, this one I've only got ah. 500 shots. No, that can... You know, what if that's all you get for the entire game? It could and happen. And I'll be stuck with the machine gun forever. Oh, no. Still not bad. So... Oh, off you go. Oh. Oh, 
I guess oh. I, I guess I okay. exploded. Now, how forgiving is this game? We didn't make it that far, so... Oh, what's up there? That's the, um... That's... Oh, that's that homing weapon. Is it, though? Yeah, it is. Right. Okay, so... Yeah, this, this game's okay. You know, it's... Seems alright. You know, you've got a bit of parallax scrolling, I can see. That's nice. Oh, uh, okay, so I can hold two different weapons at once. Right. And how do you switch? Um, X. Okay. The top button. <laughs> Alright. Um... Sorry, I'm... where am I supposed to go? Hang on. Can I get up there? Yes. I, I am I'm definitely digging this music. It's pretty funky. Yeah. I mean, it's no Tim Fallon level, but... No, but, um... Not many games have that kind of a soundtrack. It reminds me of Genesis music, but... See, I think... I There's think... a lot of SNES games that try and do Genesis music. Yeah. I guess, you know, th th those games had to have funky music, whereas these games don't. But, you know, still... The Genesis sound chip is kind of odd. Yeah. You get all that... Wow, 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 wow. This you is... Know? Yeah. Oh, but whoa. This is oh, nice. Oh, shit. Hang on. I'm not ready for... I wasn't ready for demons. No. <laughs> Alright, you, you have a go. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we are changing players. And, this, is, uh, this is let's both play, after all. Yeah, you're right. It's not let's play and I'll and be snarked upon. And, um, oh, yeah, that's right. You use the D-pad. Yeah. Of course you do. There's no, there's no analog stick on what they're using. Cause we... What's an analog stick? I don't know. Actually, it is 1996. That's when this game came out. So, Nintendo 64 exists. But, um... Yeah, you probably don't want to do that. You've only got, like, 600... And... Yeah, you're right. I've just, I, I just don't have the right instincts for this sort of game, you know? And I, see, I've already got full health. Um... Oh, is that, that's right, I'm barking up the wrong tree. <laughs> Quite literally. I wonder where that phrase came from. You know, um, when, when does a dog bark up the right tree? I don't know, if he's looking for a branch. Oh, yeah. I don't know. Is, that how, is that how dogs do things? They bark at them and no. things happen? No, I think dogs do other things than bark. You know, they dig holes and they wag their tail and they eat things and they shit and they, you know. <laughs> Dog, you know, what do humans do? They do all those things except for bark. Yeah. Oh, no, we can bark. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm not. That's I'm not, not a gonna, bark? I'm not going to do that. You're not going to pay that? No. Alright, fine, you know. <laughs> what 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 if the dog's barking wasn't recognized as legitimate? You know, same sound, but uh, okay, so I've got a game over, I think. Are we gonna continue? Yeah, uh, let's continue. Um, I guess we should give it another go. Yeah. You know, see if it it's kind to us and continues. Are we gonna get the homing gun here? Got bats. So you spawned a demon somehow, but I haven't seen them since. Yeah, maybe this is a creepy. So, so this is the realm. There's like five trees, but they're very tall trees. Yes. Well, there's also the background trees, but they don't count, you know. Yeah. As far as we know, they're they're just a picture on the background. Well, they've got some pretty sweet parallax scrolling. You know, I, I, like I said earlier in this very video. I think those sprite effects are just fantastic, you know? I really like it's them. Done, it's done, like, pretty well. Yeah. But, um, yeah, if any if any of you Kickstarter people um, want to make... want to try a concept, you know, like Shovel Knight does its NES thing, oh. can I recommend a game that, you know, does the most possible with sprite effects? Why not? Everybody you... loves sprite effects. No, I think it's just me. Like, someone might look at a Mode 7 game and think, bad graphics, man. Where's the 3D? Who Where thinks... my polygons? What? Mode 7 is 3D. Well, pseudo. Like, for, all, for all intents and purposes. A lot of people don't consider Doom 3D. They consider it um, pseudo 3D. Uh, but I think that's I think that's picking at a very small minute. Yeah. I know. Oh, shit. Um... 
Yeah, it'd be great. It'd, it'd it's just be fun. great it's to see. Coming, like, we're, we're playing on a pretty powerful computer. Imagine, imagine how fast we could rotate sprites on this. <laughs> we could have, like, thousands of rotating sprites on this screen. And they could all be it, scaling up and down. Are you talking about a bullet hell game? <laughs> yeah. Imagine if every bullet was a rotating sprite. Ooh. Yeah. I, this was, I, this, I like was not, this was not in my advantage. I, I wanted to get extra health, but I ended up losing all the What was games. the name of that brilliant bullet hell game that you saw on our Rets Prey? With the uh, Grim Reaper girl? What, Thera? Yeah, Thera. I reckon, yeah, if we funded Thera with our suggestions... Yeah, these guys move way too fast. They do. If you could fund things by suggestions, I'm sure that a lot of those a lot of those videos would... Uh... Well, that's how proper venture capitalists work. They say, I'm, I'll gladly fund your project if you take upon these following suggestions, you know, and, and get a certain return and all that. You know, that's... I'm not a venture capitalist, I'm not even a capitalist, you know. But uh, my politics is irrelevant to this video, and if you don't <laughs> agree with them, please don't be discouraged from watching this video. We've gone into the realm of politics. I, I assure you that... You are not supporting any political aims by watching this video. You're just watching this video for your own enjoyment. And I know you're well, enjoying it too. Thank I'm, you, viewers. I'm not. Yeah. Well... I've gotta say, this game isn't very inspiring. No. I mean... It starts off... It's it's Nintendo hard. It's got a... I kinda got, like that, but... It's got that nice fantasy sci-fi hybrid, you know? Like the uh, upcoming movie in a well-known franchise. But, um... <laughs> Sorry, like I, I've I've just been thinking. We've been giving You're allowed away... to name drop Star Wars. It's okay. Yeah, but I've been we've been giving away so many endorsements and advertisements for free, you know. And I just think, you know, what, Disney's not going to pay us any money, whether we endorse or not. <laughs> we, they should though. Hey, the demons dead. This is this is content. Nothing. We do not advertise for free. You know, What's sponsored content. Oh shit. Yeah, those... no, I'm I'm sick of these demons. You know what else I'm sick of? This game. Yeah. <laughs> but you know what? We're gonna get. Let's see if this We've is our life. One one last life. Zero is a life. I wonder if that there must be a band out there called Zero is a life. Zero Zero is always a life. If you don't. No, have, not always. If you don't let your players have a zero life, then it's bad. No, no, because I'm... It's like you've got zero extra lives. Yeah, yeah, that's what the counter means, but I'm, I did, there definitely is a game where zero isn't a life. Let us know in the com comments below, um, and we'll give you a free video. We'll uh, name drop you at the start of our next video, if you can tell us okay. a game in which zero is I'm not, not a life. <laughs> it's just People a don't quick Google. On my videos. <laughs> it, it, it's just a quick Google for you guys. You Google it. Write it in the comments. That's all you need to do to get our favour, right? Did you say you Google it? You Google it, yeah. You Google it. You Google. <laughs> um, because uh, you know, we'll just forget most of the things that we say, but hopefully it will live on in your hearts. And you know, oh. things are just words oh. we put out into space. Oh, it's like it's like that other weapon, except you've got ammo. Um, it's a pulse rifle. Yep. Oh shit, I've, got, I've also got no health. Oh, wait. Now we're auto-scrolling? Oh no. Is that a boss? Yes. Oh, cool. Oh, what? That, that's a cool tree face. That's a... Oh look, it had little bouncy that's balls. an interesting tree. Now, this is an interesting prospect, because uh, the clock's I'm gonna ticking. Give it, I'm going to give it one more go. Alright. We're not, we're not quite at the 15 minute mark yet. Just when you thought we were about to give up, if you close the video during that continue screen, because we said we were going to give up, then uh, you're missing out, because this is extra time, baby. <laughs> yeah, but they'll never know they were missing out because they stopped watching the video. Mm. That's interesting, you know? That's a, that's an interesting reflection on life itself. You don't you don't know what you're missing out on when you die, because you just don't care anymore. So I think everyone gets what they want. People who wanted to see more video get that. People who didn't want to see more video, they're out of there and they don't think they've missed anything. Except, of course, I'll see at the time bar. And, uh, yeah. You know, that, that could have just been ads or endorsements or, hey guys, subscribe to my channel, yo. Subscribe to my channel, I'll give you lots of likes. Yeah. On Tumblr. Yeah. And, and I will upvote your posts on Reddit if you subscribe to my videos. Yeah. Please, guys, I'm so desperate for likes. Yeah. 
it's the only measure of my success. Also, thanks to all our patrons on Patreon, um, we aren't on it yet, but when we are, <laughs> I want you to be able to look at our old videos and still feel that we like you, you know? So here's to the future, where we're very well funded by Patreon. And right. you from the future who's funding us, thank I've you. Got, I've got some health this time. Yeah. Take that tree. Actually, this is... Is this game a clone oh. of Kirby? Is this, like, I don't think so. dark version of Kirby? Oh, shit. Oh! See, I'm... Um, fan of Messian, Sakako, whatever. He's a very well versed in bullet hell games so uh this is natural territory for you know this is like breathing yeah this is this is okay this pattern is like pretty simple yeah except the yeah. hitbox on those bullets yeah so this level's actually not very long it doesn't seem to be but uh yeah living trees yeah. i think this game could have been something it's just I wonder how much love was put into this game. Who who cares about realm? Yeah, that's that's not just you know we're asking. If you care about realm, uh, if leave, you, let if us you grew up on this game, yeah. I mean, I mean you could be. This is good music. You could be very nostalgic for this funky music. Um, I still don't know what the lock functionality does. No. I mean, it, is, it, it assured me that I would get a lock, but no. I don't know what the lock does. Well, yeah. What if there's a door which enemies come out of and you can lock it? Oh, that would be nice. Yeah. You know, except locks, locks ain't locks in video games. You know, actually, there's a, there's a good philosophical message in this game. It, the best way to avoid de your demons is just to ignore them. You know? What, what's that field of psychology? You know, just ignore your demons? Who knows? What we do know is that, yep, the tree hasn't smartened up since we were last here, which is good. It just, it's gotten complacent thinking that, you know, the same pattern is good enough to kill us. And you know what? Actually, it is. It was right. Do you know what? I'm gonna, I'm just gonna call it zero is not a life are you yeah zero yeah. is not a life yeah because when you're being told that you're a zero what kind of life can you live anyway all you can do is just wait for the vultures to peck you to death it's inevitable really yeah in the words of Hugo this game Ruby. is going to end it might end with a nice saying well done and some credits and Although I have a feeling this might be one of those games that just says the just end. Just like the end, yeah. Or, or just goes straight back to the title screen. Or, yeah. um, you know. Alright, here we go. Now we made it back to the tree. Yeah, with We're getting life. better at this game. Mm. No. no. So, I just um, ran through all the enemies. No, hang on. <laughs> if uh, any viewers want to give us a call, don't. Um, I don't want to say my phone number over YouTube, and in fact it will be the past by the time you say, Shit! Shit! Continue! Fuck. No, no, no. The <laughs> game's over. Continue. Uh, is there a sound test? I think that's the sort of thing you'd need to unlock, but um, no, no. I like the I like the colours in the background though. This game would be really great in a dark room. Yeah. <laughs> if you uh, have a lot of darkness in your life, I recommend Realm. Realm. It won't make you feel better, it'll just match you. <laughs> Realm for the SNES. <laughs>